Hi, I'm Jen Miller. Welcome to Simply Interval. And guess what? This is a hard workout. If you're a beginner, or even if you're intermediate, you may not want to try this workout. Go to one of our other workouts like Everybody Steps or Simply Step. Now, interval training is hard work efforts followed by recoveries or rests. Today, helping me is going to be Mandy. She's going to be showing you a less intense version of every combination. And guess what, guys? I want you to work as hard as you can within the combination for the time that I give you the go interval cue. So we're going to go through a series of combinations. You're going to work as hard as you can after you know what the options are to work at. And then we're going to stop, rest, do another one, stop, rest, and get all the way through our workout until the very end when you're absolutely exhausted. It's going to be a great workout. It burns a lot of calories and it's a good hard cardio challenge. Now, during the workout, every time we do a work interval, we'll follow it by a rest. During that rest interval, you'll see a chart fly onto your screen. That's our energy exertion chart. That tells you how hard you're working during the interval. Now, normally, during a regular aerobic workout, you're gonna work somewhere between three and seven. But guess what? During interval training, you're gonna be somewhere between seven and 10. 10 being an all out sprint and seven being very hard. Now, if you get to the 10 for the whole time during the interval, you're working too hard. You need to pull it back down, maybe go with Mandy for a while, or march it out. And remember, for interval training, you're also going to set your step height a little lower than normal. Remember, drink water before, during, and after this workout, and go at your own pace. All right, if you're ready, we're going to kick some butt. We're going to get to the warm-up. Okay, let's start marching on the right foot if you're ready. Ready, Mandy? Here we go. March it out. Nice and tall, guys. Good posture here is very important. We're going to take some deep breaths, but first we're going to start with just the right arm up and overhead. Curve it up and exhale. Good. Now the left arm, same thing. Curve it up and overhead. Beautiful. Can I have two more just like that? Curve it up and over. That a way to work. One more time right here. Next, you're going to roll your shoulders back and down, both at the same time. Back and down. That's it. Here's three. Good. And you're just going to march it out like you mean it right here, Mandy. I want you to watch me for just a second. Don't do it yet. Watch me only. I'm going to do a basic step and then march in place. You ready, Mandy? Here we go. Basic step, march in place right here. Like you mean it. Basic step. That's it. March in place. Stay right there. Basic step. March in place. Beautiful. Basic step. March in place. Now we're going to do knee up. You ready, Mandy? One knee up here and on the other side. March in place. That's it. Stay right there. Just getting you good and warm here. Give me that knee up again. Knee up, knee up again. March in place. Stay right there. How you feeling? Getting a little warmer? Getting that heart rate up? Give me those knees up. Right here. Do it again. March in place. Right there. Stay there. You got one more after this. Here we go. Step knee up. Knee up. March in place. Now, next thing we're going to do is heel digs. Right foot, left foot. Here we go. Push it out. That's it. Good. Stay with that. There you go. That's it. Now you're just going to reach and pull like you're doing a row here. Reach, pull, reach, pull, reach. After four more, you're going to hold. Three, two, not this one, but the next one. You're going to hold right here. Slide those hands behind your head and lean forward. Pitch your chest forward. Pitch your hips back. Come on up again. And unload. Turn to this side. Turn your knees and your toes out. Give me a plie squat. Hands inside your thighs. Flip over that shoulder. Good. Now, pitch yourself back, lengthen the legs on front of that platform, and stretch that inner thigh for me right there. Beautiful job. You're going to sweep back to the front. Let that right heel hang off. Step up with that left foot. Give me a nice little calf stretch there, about two-thirds of your weight into that heel. In four more, we're going to very gently bend that right knee. Let that left leg come down and march out. You ready, Mandy? Here we go. March it out. Good. Nice and tall. Beautiful. I want you to take a deep breath with both hands for me. Inhale up and exhale down. One more time. Inhale up and exhale. Now basic with that left. Here we go. Take it up and down. March it out right here. Beautiful. Like you mean it. Now I want you to really get after this and pronounce each part of this movement because when you start taking those intervals into their full effect, this will be tough for you. Right here. We're going to go to knee ups next. Ready, man? Knee up. Do it again. Right here. March it out. Stay there. Beautiful. Four. Three. 
two. Give me those knees up right here. Next time we do the knee ups, I want you to stay with Mandy, but I want you to watch what I'm going to show you. It's an alternating press back. She'll do knee ups. Press back right here. March it out right there. Good. Want to try it? We're going to do it together. Here we go. Press back. Beautiful. Again. March it out. Stay right there. All right. We're going to go to those press backs. We're going to keep doing them. Ready, Mandy? Keep doing them. Now, during the intervals, the work efforts, you're going to be working as hard as you can between that 7 and 10 on that scale. During the rest, you have two choices. You can stay with Mandy on this movement pattern right here, which is an alternating lift, or you can go with me, and I'll be marching just like this. So when you're resting, you've got a couple of choices. Your active rest or your almost complete rest right here. You know what I mean? How about some heel digs? Ready? Here we go. Heel digs. Stay there. So you got a couple of choices, guys. It's up to you. Beautiful. Pull like you're going to row. Reach. Pull. Pull. Shoulders back and down. After four, we're going to hold this one, too. This one here. Hold. Right here. Press down. Right there with your hands here. Good. Now, hips are pushing back that hamstring stretch. You're going to unload, push away, turn your knees out, turn toward us. And that's a rotation stretch for the core. Unload one more time, push to the back of the room. And you've got an inside thigh stretch right there. Take some deep breaths here. Exhale. Good. Turn back to the front, front. Slide that left heel off. Step up on the right. Now, stretch that calf out right there. Good. You're going to march it out, right leg. Here we go. And march it out. And that's what it's going to feel like to start and then stop. And then to start and then stop. So you're going to have high intensity and then you're going to have rest. So let's march here. All right. Look at your screen right now. Here comes your chart. It's flying in. You see there are all those numbers? You're going to be between 7 and 10 on the hardest interval. Okay? You're normally between 3 and 7 when you do regular aerobic activity, but intervals as hard as you can work within your own fitness level. So that's where you want to be, right there between that 7 and 10. All righty. All right, come on back to us. So be prepared to look at that. Now, during the workout, if you work too hard, you're up at 10 all the time, come back to this march, okay? Or follow Mandy's version of the activity. If you're not working hard enough, you can take your step height up or go with me. All right, you ready? Knees up. Here we go. Step knee. Right here. Good. Stay with that. We're going to travel with this. Go this way first. We're working on our first combination here, and I'm going to graduate you up with a little bit of steady state here, nice and tall. Good. Give me three knees repeating, Mandy. Here's three. Nice and tall, guys. Good posture. Do it on the other side right here. Three, two, other side right there. Come on. Nice and tall. Remember, the impact is not on the leg going down, but you're stabilizing on the leg that's up. Give me five repeaters here. Five, four, three. March it out on the floor right here. Don't move, don't move. Just keep marching. Five knees right here. Five, four, three, two. March it out on the floor right here, right here. Good. We're going to add on to that. Five knees right here. After these five knees, you're going to give me a basic step. Basic right here. Basic right here. Five knees right there. Very simple. Four, three, two. Basic right here. We're going to add on from there. Five knees right here. Five, four, three. Basic right here. Next, you're going to give me a B step with arms swinging and swaying right there. There you go. How you feeling, Mandy? She looks good. Isn't she cute? Five knees right here. Five knees. Five, four, three, two. Give me a basic right here. Give me the V step right here. Here we go. Four. Here's three. Two more. Good. If you want to make it harder, watch how you'll be doing it. Five knees. You can hop the knees. Three. Four, and run the basic right here. You can walk the V or run it. Looks like this. Now you have a choice of doing any or all of those moves. Let's go back to the repeaters. I'll show you. Here's your first choice. Hop it. Mandy will be hopping. Now give me a basic run or a walk. V's that run. She'll be just hopping the knee ups and running the basic, but she'll just be walking this V step. Ready? March it out. Here we go. March it out. All right. Breathe in. Are you ready to get after it? you got one minute. You go harder, harder, harder. You can do the hops with Mandy and the runs, and then the walks on the knees, or you can go all the way with me, hop, run, run. Ready? Five knees. Here we go. Pump it. Four, three, two. On that basic right here. V-step any way you like. Come on. That's it. Come on. 
Good. Keep it going. Watch your step. Watch your step. Beautiful. Five knees. Let's go. Let's go. Hop it. Five, four, three, two. Run that basic right here, guys. Run and walk the V's. Four. That's it. Three. Remember to walk down. Don't run down. Give me the five knees right here, guys. Here we go. Five, four, three, two. Run that basic right here. Bees. Let's go. Run if you like. Come on. Where you get more bent knees. Remember to bend from the hips, not the back. Five knees. Let's go. Right here. Five, four, three, two. Basic run and walk. Give me that V. Give me that V right here. How we doing? Probably wanting to know how much longer. Five knees. Let's go. Here we go. Five, four, three, two. Run that basic. Give me those four these right here. We've only got one more. Then you'll be all finished with this. You'll get the rest. Are you ready for the five knees? Let's go. Five, four, three, two. Run the basic. Walk and run the V's. Your choice. After this, you'll be doing the rear leg lift with Mandy, and I'll be doing the march. Ready? Rest it now. Here comes your chart. Check it out. Okay, you guys, ready for that next combination? How'd you do on that chart? Do you need to work harder or do you need to work easier? It's your choice. Remember, it's your workout. We're going to start with an L step off this end. Ready? Here we go. Tap back on this. Come back to the front. Go to the other side. Give me an L step here. Tap back to the front. Good. Let me have two more just like that. L step. See how you're going to tap back before you come up. Don't bend so much at the waist, more at the hips right here. Now you're going to give me four taps back, front, back, front right here. Eh, eh. L step. March in place on the floor, right there. Good. You're going to do that again, right here. Watch my feet. Watch. Four, three, two, one. I'm going to L-step. March your jog, right here. You want to try it with me? Give me those scissors if you like. Tap back first. Four, three, two, one. L-step. And jog or march. You're doing great. Give me that L-step. Scissor or tap right here. Four, three, two, one. Jog or march. Now, Mandy's going to go into the lift steps. Watch what I'm going to do. Watch. Watch. Four, three, two, one. Hop, 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 switch. Then it goes into lunges. Now, I'm going to do this one more time so you can see it. You're going to stay with Mandy. Then you'll feel good about it. Watch me again. It's an L step. I'm going to tap or scissor right here. Three hops. One, two, three. And then you go right into your lunges. I'll catch down from seven. Five, four, three, two. Want to do it with us, Mandy? Let's go. L step. Tap or scissor right here. Three hops right here. One, two, three. Now lunge. That's it. That's it. Stay with that. You got three more. Three, two. Come on down. It's no march. Go right to the L step. Tap back or scissor right here. Four, three, two, three hops. One, two, three. Here. That's it. How you doing? Is that making you crazy? Made us crazy too. <laughs> three, two. Go back to the leg press with Mandy right here. I'm going to add one more element to this. On the three hops, I'll be taking those same foot hopping across the top of the platform. Be very careful. Very advanced move. You can roll your ankle, so be very careful. All right, watch me first. Stay with Mandy. Watch me first. L, scissor here. Then I'm going to hop. Three, two, one. Bam! Right here. Now watch what I do with these. I got three more. I'm going to come down. You're going to stay with Mandy. Stay with Mandy. Watch one more time. I'm going to go here. One, two, three. Three, four, bam, 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 ha. Then I'm gonna go off the end like this. Whoa. Right here, real deep lunge off that end. Three, two, everybody march it out right here. Woo! You ready for your interval? It's gonna last one minute. Breathe here for a second. I'm gonna count you down, we're gonna go. Anything you want, and he's gonna keep her hop in place. You ready for that L step? Let's go, L step, tap or scissor right here. Three hops and place her across. Lunge back now. I'm going to go to the side. Get deep on these sides. Step way back. You got three more. Three, two, step down. Give me the L step off this side. Tap or scissor right here. Give me those hops. Bam, 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 bam. I'm going to go off the end. She's going to stay to the front. That's it. Three, 
two, come on down, L-step goes right over here. Scissor or tap right here. <laughs> yeah, three hops, switch, lunge, right here. I'm gonna go off the end. Three more, three, two. You ready for your last one? L-step off this side. Give me those scissors like you mean it. Three hops. Off the end right here. Woo. Keep going, keep going, keep going. You got three more. When you come back, you're gonna give me the alternating press with Mandy or march with me. Right here. Woo! That was good. That was tough. Check the chart. All right, we're gonna move on to our next combination and it's gonna start with traveling side outs. Are you ready, Mandy? Let's go. She's almost doing them anyway, right there. Now, if you don't like this lift step, instead of lifting up off the platform, you could do a long tap, looks like this, right here. And sometimes, even though that's less impact, it's a little harder because you're bending your legs a little more. So continue with whichever you'd like right here. Good, stay with that. Now, if you wanna make this harder, you can actually add a leap to it, guys. You ready? Here we go leap. That's kind of an intermediate level. And what you have to do here on this leap is make sure that you cushion the blow. So control your impact here. Nice and tall. Watch where you're going. Here's my version. Really nasty. Right here. And that's very advanced. So don't do it if you don't want. Go back to the grounded version right here. All righty. We're going to be adding something to this. It's going to be heel digs. So right now, right, left heel dig right here. You are gonna swim or gather some power right here, okay? Good, in eight more, we're gonna do side lunges, diagonal lunges on the floor. Are you ready, Mandy? Here we go. Diagonal lunges right there, that's it, good. Now this is pretty tough here. If you wanna make it tougher, get a little lower. That makes it even tougher, right here. You're very flexible and you're an athlete, you can touch down right here, touch. Now, the only thing about this is we are going to hold the last one. So after seven more, when I count you down, you're going to hold the last one. Ready? Three, two. After this one, hold. Side out right there. There you go. Again. Two more. Keep it grounded. Heel digs next right here. Left, right, left. Now, keep these heel digs. I'm going to show you how to make them harder. Watch me kind of a leap. You can try this with me when you're ready. Are you ready? Try it. In four more, we're going to go to diagonal lunges on the ground, heading that way first. Here we go. Bam. There you go. That's it. So if you're upright, they're pretty easy. You get lower. They're harder. And you know what's hardest, don't you? When you get lowest and you touch down. Right here. Three, two, next one, hold, side out right there. How'd you do? How'd you do, Mandy? All right, stay with this, stay with this. Here we go, four, here's three. Two more, put it all together now. Heel digs right here in the front. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Ready for diagonal lunges, here we go. That's it, good. Keep it. I want you to give me seven more. The eighth one holds. Five, four, three, two. This one holds, side out right here. That's that whole combination. Again, two more. That's it, heel digs. Give me those arms. Eight, seven, six. This was hard, isn't it? <laughs> Are you ready for diagonal lunges, Mandy? Here we go. This is not easy on the grounded version, and it's really nasty on the high intensity version. So you're gonna have to pace yourself on this. Five, four, three, two, hold it, march it right. Right here, breathe. Your interval's coming up, guys. It's gonna be nasty, watch your step. Pace yourself. Come down to a grounded version if you need to. Mandy will do an easier version. Ready for side out, Mandy? Let's go. Two more. Right here. Heel digs right here. 
I'm doing the highest intensity. Stay balanced. Lunges right here. That's it. Get low. I'm going to go ahead and touch down. After seven, you're going to hold. Six, five, four. After three, after two, after this one, hold. Side out. Let's go. That's it. Come on. Again. Again. Heel digs like you mean it. Five, seven, six, five, four, three. Diagonal lunges. Let's go. Right here. Breathing hard. Beautiful. Good. Can I have eight more? Can you do one more round? No? Three, two. Hold it. March right. Woo! All right. How do we do? If you don't want to march and you still have something left, do those press backs. Here we go. There you go. All right. Take a look at that chart. Let's see where you are. Go there now. Oh, we are moving on. How you feeling right now? You're kicking your own, you know what? <laughs> I hope so, because we are. <laughs> all right, in a few more, all we're going to do is march on top with our right leg. I'll cue you after this one. No, after this one. <laughs> march on top right here. March on top. I want to show you something. You stay with this march. After I show you, you can join me. It's a rear lunge, three presses. Looks like this. Three, two, one. This is our strength interval. It's just as tough as all the other ones, guys. you got to step way back. Try it with me, Mandy. Here we go. Three. Gotta step way back. Keep that knee over that foot. Push back as you come up. Your hands come in front like you're catching a ball. And then throw them back. Three, two, one. Beautiful. Now, if you want to make this harder, guys, on the up, you can try a jump. Three, two, one. Jump. So you're going to explode up. And that's a little plyometrics. Jump. Three, two, one. Jump. Three, <laughs> two, one. Good. Now three presses. Watch what I do on this. Don't do it yet. Watch me again. Don't do it yet. You don't have to try it unless you want to. Try it if you like. Two, one, scissor, three, two, one, scissor, three, two, one, scissor, three, two, one. March right on top, right here. Woo! How are we doing? All right, now, there's one more element to this. The three lunges, when they go back, they move. It's nasty. Stay marching. Watch me. Looks like this. Three, two, one. Switch, switch. Three, two, one. Try it if you like. Three, two, one. Switch, switch. Three, two, one. Switch, switch, and I'm going to march it right. All right. <laughs> Are you ready? <laughs> this is going to be tough. If you stay with Mandy, she's doing the three press backs and the jump on top. If you're going with me, you're going to start over here. Three lunges, move them this way. Here we go. Three, two, scissor. Three, two, scissor. Going to make sure those legs are good and far apart and the rear leg is traveling on its toe. Keep your weight centered. Right here. Three, two, one, scissor. Three, two, one, scissor. Three, two, one, scissor. Three, you got about 30 seconds to go, I think. Right here. Three, get tired of the scissors, you can just do this. Three, two, switch and hold, see? Three, two, hold, switch. Three. Okay, you got four more to go, right here. Three. Two, one, scissor. Three, two, one, scissor. Three, two, one, scissor. Three, two, one, scissor. And march it out, right leg. Woo! That kicked me, kicked me in the you know what. All right, check the chart. How you feeling? I should have taken you up.
Okay, we're ready for our next combination, and you know it's a real tough one. It's shifts. And what we're going to do right now is just kind of go into them. I'll show you. Watch me first. Stay with Mandy. It just looks like this. So when you're ready, shift right, left. Here we go. Right, left. You put your hands up like this. Now, if you shift one foot to the other, it's much harder than if you just shift your hips. So you got foot lifts or just hip shifts, okay? We're going to do seven and then do alternating knee up. Seven, six, five, four, three, hold here, knee up, right here, then another one. Seven shifts that way, let's go. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, knee up, here. So the last shift gets a knee up on the trail leg, let's go. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, hold, knee up, right here, one more time. Seven shifts, let's go. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, knee up, right here, one more time. Good, let's go, seven shifts. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, knee up. Huh. Huh. Did you see me? Try it. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Huh. Huh. Seven shifts. Next time, Mandy's gonna do a side kick. Three, two, one. Huh. Huh. Seven shifts. Seven, six, five, four, three, two. She's gonna do a side kick. Huh. I'm going to do front. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Ha! Ha! Seven, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Ha! You got options. Ha! March it out. Right leg. That was hard already. I'm going to add to that. On the shift, you can punch. Watch me. See what I mean? That's what you're going to get to do. Let's go to the right. Here it is. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, hold, kick, ha. Do it again. Ha. Seven, right here. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, hold, kick. Do it again. Kick. Give me a shift. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, hold. Ha. Do it again. Ha. Seven, seven, six, five, four, three, two, hold, kick. This time on the shifts, on the lift. Watch. Again. Last time. Seven, six, five, three, two, hold, kick. Do it again. Last one. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, kick. Ha! Again. March it out. Right leg. Woo! <sighs> Check your chart. Okay, we're moving on now. We're gonna do some alternating front kicks. Are you ready, Mandy? We're gonna go that way first. Here we go, front kicks. Just easy stuff right here. Easy stuff. In a minute, we're gonna change our arms. Watch these arms. I'm gonna swim and in the middle. Swim and in the middle. Now, on this move, guys, don't let the tail wag the dog. Keep your abs pulled in, stay nice and tall. Let me have four more. Here's three. Two more. Last one. Now, you're gonna give me three knees repeating right here. Easy three knees. Three. Two, one, do it again, right here. Three, two, one, two more, right here. Three, two, one. We're building this combination, okay? Next, you're gonna go one knee, three touches, in, out, in, in, out, in. Good, do it again, over there. One knee up, three touches, in, out, in. Beautiful, we're gonna count it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Remember the counts. I want you to watch me in the next one. Stay with Mandy. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Try it with your hands. Up, two, three, four, five. They come down on your thighs each time. One, two, keep your chest lifted. Do it again. Now watch the hardest version of this. I'm gonna explode on five. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, 
seven, eight. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Two, three, four. March it out. Right leg. Here we go. Woo. I think you want me to do the interval with you now. Are you kidding me? Way too tired. Okay. So, on the kicks. Swim. Explode. Pull out. Whatever you have. Let's go. Kick. Five. Kick your hand. Don't let your hand touch your leg. Two more. Right here. One more. Give me that repeater. Up, down, in, out, explode. Or any way you want. Four more. Right here. In, out, explode. Do it again. Right here. Up, down, in, out. <laughs> again. Up, down, in, out. Float. One more time. And you're going to go to the swim kick on the other side. Ready? Here we go. Swim. Right here. That's it. Good. Two more times. One more time. Repeater. Up, down, in, out, explode. Up, down, in, out. Float. Four more. Here. Do it again. Up, down, in, out. Again. Right here. That's it. Now after this, we're just going to march it out and watch me. March it out and watch me. Finish up with this when you're ready. We'll stay with Mandy on the straight leg lifts. She's going to step and press back when I tell her to. Are you guys ready? You do the holding pattern. Here we go, guys. There you go. I just need eight more from you. Just a little tail here. Give you a run for your money. Four, three, two, march right. Ha 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 ha. Check the charge. Come on back to us when you can. Okay, I like this next combination because it's three side moves, a march, a stride, and then taps on top. Lindy this way for three. Here we go. Here's three. Give me another Lindy that way. Double shuffle, step back. One more. March four times, go a stride, tap up, back foot first. Four, three, two. Now go over here and hold three presses. Three, two, other side. Shuffle around. Here we go. Shuffle and step back. Good. Shuffle and step back. March for four. Get a stride. Tap your back foot up first. Four. Three, two, hold this leg up and give me three presses and go on over, march it out right here. Now, we're gonna continue, but to do our interval, we're gonna keep those three presses into a pendulum. Give me the Lindy. Three, two more. One more, march, go a stride. Right here, give me taps on top. Four, three, two, three presses. Now, you're gonna give me two pendulums on top right here. Pendulum and three. One, pendulum, three, two, one, pendulum, three, two, one. Now this one's gonna go over the top. No pendulum. Take it over, give me those lindies. Here we go. Three, two more. One more. Four marches, get to a stride. Tap your back leg up first. Here we go. Four, three, two. Give me four presses on the ground. Three, I mean. Two, pendulum right here. Do it again. Three, two, one. Pendulum, three, two, one. Pendulum, three, two, one. Here's your last one. It's gonna go all the way over, and we're gonna march it out. March it out. Okay, the next version of this that's super hard is on the taps that you do back foot first. I'm gonna double time those. You don't have to do those. You can just watch me, and that'll be an option for you when we get to our interval. Are you ready for the Lindy? Let's go. Three, just watch me on this one, two. One more, you're gonna march it out and get a stride. Watch the tap sequence right here. Three, two, pendulum. Do it again. Three, two, one. See how I'm gonna jump this? I'm gonna do that next time and show it to you. You don't have to jump it, you can press it. Now this time you're gonna go over, take the Lindy to the left, you're gonna do the whole thing as hard as it can look. Two more. One more. March it into a stride. Double time the foot. This is hardest. Three presses. Give me the pendulum. 
I'm gonna go ahead and jump. Last one just goes over, and you're gonna march it on that right foot. All right, you ready for your interval? You decide. Here we go. Three, Lindy Mandy, two more. One more, march it into that stride position, back leg first for four. Four, three, two, give me three presses right here. Three, two, pendulum. Do it again. Three, two, one, pendulum. Three, two, one, pendulum. Make sure you got good support. Don't drop that chest. Three presses, you're gonna get to the other side, over the top, give me the Lindy. Three, Woo. one more. March of stride right here. Tap on top, back foot right here. Four, three, two. Give me three presses right here. Three, two, go to the pendulum. I'm gonna jump them. Three, two, one, pendulum. Three, two, one, pendulum. Three, two, one, pendulum. Take it over, march right, right here. <laughs> there you go. I think that was about a minute. And if it was, check your chart. You're doing good, we're getting next to the end, get close to the end, keep going. This comes from my webmaster, Mary Griffin. It's a real cute one. It's jacks. Watch me first. Stay with this march. I'm gonna go up and two jacks. I'm gonna come on back down and give me three jacks right here. Two. Then you're gonna go back up. Three lunges. Three. Two. Come on down. Four jacks. That's all it is. Then we're gonna trade sides. But let's all do it together. Right foot up. Here we go. Up, up. Two jacks. Come on down. Right foot. Three jacks. Three. Two. Go on back up. Right foot. Three lunges. Three. Two. Come on down, give me four jacks right here. Next time we go up, we're gonna be going up with that left foot. Up, up, two jacks, up, up, two jacks. Come on down, give me three jacks. Three, two, go on back up, lunge it. Three, two, come on down, four jacks, four, three. Now we're gonna run it, march in place, right leg. All right, now to make it harder, guys, instead of just the rear lunge, give me a real pop up on that lunge. That makes it harder. Ready, right foot up, here we go, two jacks. Come on down, three jacks, three, two, come on up, give me those lunges, three, two, one, come on down, four jacks, there you go, this is all Mary here, left foot up, let's go, two jacks, up, up, jack, jack, back down, three jacks, three, two, up, up, three lunges, three, two, one, four jacks, watch, I'm gonna go, power, right leg goes up, here we go, up, two jacks, Come on down, three jacks, three, two, up, up, lunge right here, three, watch, two, one, four jacks, Woo this next one, I'll show it to you all the way, left leg, up, up, two, down, three jacks, three, two, up, up, three lunges, watch mine, three, two, one, come on down, power, after this, you're going to march it out, right leg, here it is, Woo. you get to pick, one of those fun options you want to perform. Are you ready? We're going to start with the right leg. And we're going to go for a minute or a minute and a half. We don't know what. Right leg. Here we go. Up, up. Jack twice. Come on down. Three jacks. Three, two. Up, up. Lunge it. Three, two. Come on back down. Just power jacks or four fast. Left leg's going to go up for two jacks. Up, up. Two. Down. Three jacks. There you go. Up, up. Right here, lunge. Three, two, one. Power or fast. We have two more sets. Right leg up, two jacks. Up, two jacks. Back down, three jacks. Three, two. Up, up, right leg, lunge it. Lunge, lunge. Come on down. Power or fast jacks. Last set, left leg up. Come on, up, up. Jack, jack. Down, down. Up, up, 
Lunge it. Three. <laughs> Smack that in. Power or fast. Last one. March it right. Ah. We're going into the cool down. Stay right there. Chart's coming to see ya. Check it out. Okay, we're getting ready to slow this down. March here, slow it down. There you go. Whew. Gotta cool this puppy down. Now look, if that routine wasn't hard enough for you, you better go see Tarzan or Jane or somebody. Because <laughs> I don't even work harder than that. <laughs> right here, pump it out. Let me see a little attitude. Right there. How you doing, Mandy? She is so cute, and she's a good girl. She was a trooper on this, because this was not easy. <laughs> and if it wasn't easy for you, it's not supposed to be. It's interval training, it's high intensity workloads, followed by rest. It's optimal for increasing your fitness level. You need to do this two days a week. Tuesdays, maybe then Fridays, with a 48 hour rest between. Remember, your intervals can be anywhere from 45 to 75 seconds. If you want to go out and do this in the high school, get to the track and sprint around seven to 10 times. Heel dig, let's go. Heel. Woo. Heart rate coming down yet? I hope so. If it's not, just walk around your step a few more times. Give yourself a few walking laps around the room. Crisscross those arms right here. Hug yourself. Hug. That's right. Hug that inner child. Good. There you go. I was looking at all my report cards with Mary. And they all had, Virginia does not pay attention. Virginia does not turn in her work. Virginia talks too much in class. Virginia has to go to the bathroom all the time. Virginia can't sit still. <laughs> On the next one, we're going to hold right here. Hold it. Slide that hand back. Lean forward. Press that back heel into the ground. Now, your calves are going to be sore here, and your legs are going to be sore. So you want to push back into the floor with your heel. Now, bend your knee, and you get a little soleus stretch, too. Okay? If your leg is straight, you get a little more ham and hip flexor. You bend the knee a little bit, you get a little soleus. All right. Ease that back leg up. Hands behind your back and sit. Lean back. Push that hip way back. Good. Keep your shoulders square. How you feeling, Mandy? Ooh. It does, doesn't it? We're going to come up and slide over this way. Step away. Give me that inside thigh stretch. Right there. Good. Come on in. Knees turn out. Give me that twist. Just like the warm-up. Oh, doesn't that rotational stretch feel good? Here's three. In two more, take the foot off the platform, march it out, left leg, march it out. We're going to slow it down. Left, right, heel dig, left, right. Here we go. Left, left. Give me a little right here. All the way back and down, back and down. Big arm circles, good. Last one, hold it right here. Hold it, pull your hands back, press down, sit back. Oh, man, doesn't that feel good? Hold it right there. Beautiful. Now we're just going to switch, and this time we're going to push back into that calf stretch now. Just a little different. Lean into that forward leg. Keep your knee behind your toe. Drive back into that heel, and then soften your knee and push down into that heel. Just the same, not toward the ground, but just so you feel this, the lower part of the calf. Stay there. Unload. Shift your weight right here and push away inside of your shoe if you want for that inside thigh stretch. You can even put one hand out to counterbalance if you need to. Stay there for four more. Three. That was such a hard workout. Hope you're sweating. Bring it back here. Hands here. Twist. Look over that left shoulder. Stay right there. Keep your abs pulled in. Take a deep breath. And exhale. Bring this foot together right here. Face front. Take a deep breath. And exhale. I'm Jen Miller, my good friend Mandy helping me today. We hope you got a great workout. We sure did. We're going to go sit down and have a glass of water. See you next time. Bye.